Michael Happy here from Gavox Watches and here today we will talk about the Gavox Rhodes. Well, the story behind the Gavox Rhodes starts as I was requested to join a meeting and be a sponsor of a very big event in the car industry in Belgium. So in this event, they were receiving one watch from Omega. At the end of the event, the winner received that watch. And I was asked to take over from Omega to propose a watch to this event. It's the fleet manager of the year. It's celebrating the company and the fleet manager who managed to do the most for a different car and brand. And due to that, I decided to create a road collection. Of course, it falls super nice in the Gavox feel where I do everything higher, everything deeper, farther on sea and farther on land. And this is where the Gavox road stands. Now, my three first watches, I didn't make it for a car in particular, but I did it for a road trip. I enjoyed, when young, doing a road trip. I was at my 20th in New York, traveling all the way to Canada and then down south to California with a car just for fun. And this was a great road trip. During that road trip, I found one of the best road ever. I was in Canada going from Banff to Jasper and I made a Gavox road that talks about that road. This is the Gavox Road Icefield Parkway and then the back of the case you will have a road trip like all the others. A road trip that speaks about the destination to take during your trip. What do I need in such a watch? I need a chronograph, good timing of course, because it's a Swiss quartz movement there from Moronda. I need to have a chronograph of 12 hours because it's a long trip, an alarm to wake you up in the morning or make a marker for your step in different distance. And all this watch has the whole road trip on the back. So now, you heard about the Gavox Icefield Parkway. I made one for Norway, the Atlantic Road. And the Atlantic Road is this beautiful road that goes over 20 bridges from one place to another to, tr to cross a fjord. And somewhere you need to go. Little story, if you're there during a really stormy night, your car may be washed away. Very dangerous road, never go there during uh, a, a storm. Now, the other one is made for the California Highway 1. Some of you in California, California call it the PCH, Pacific Coastal Highway. And this again has on the back of the case the whole road trip from, uh, from San Francisco to San Diego. And I couldn't stop making the three. I also decided to create, with the Gavox Road Collection, one for Lotus. And why? I was asked to create a limited edition for the fan of the Gavox Lotus car from a Belgium importer, from House of Speed. And this is it. A very racing green color into the watch. Now, I create other homage, homage watches relating to cars, this is an homage for the Porsche 917. You would see this green on the same car that first raced the 917 in Le Mans. And uh, it has the same idea and pictures and images and it was celebrating 50 years. So. Thank you very much for following me about this Gavox Road Collection. Some new one may come soon, but till now, I just want to thank you. See you another time. Bye-bye.